So it's that time again, jailbreak update week, alright? So the update should be coming out later tonight, and uh, you know, this time the update might not be as great as the updates we had back in December and January, okay? So in case you guys haven't seen the new update stuff, I'm gonna go ahead and come over here to Asimo's uh, Twitter and Badimo and everyone like that. So the first thing we're doing is obviously Asimo's favorite thing to do, and that is play a round of lighting, and uh, you know, we're gonna get like a new nighttime, like skybox and everything, okay? So, you know, it looks uh, something like this. The city will be like that. Uh, you know, this is like all cool and stuff. But you gotta remember, this does not affect gameplay whatsoever. Well, maybe it does make it a little bit harder, easier to see stuff like that. But that is like almost negligible. You see, with these like cosmetic changes, the only thing you're really like doing is it's almost like reskinning a helicopter, okay? So if I have a helicopter like this, you know, I can fly it around like this perfectly fine. And then when I change the skin a little bit, I can still fly the helicopter perfectly fine. Well, the only thing that I can like imagine that like a cosmetic change would be would be like if I come over here and uh, let's just hide this thing real quick. But let's say uh, we come and make the body color. Where's the red? Yeah, let's make it a red whenever we are a uh, police officer. That's probably like the only advantage you can probably get, okay? If you like trick the criminals into thinking that it's a fellow criminal heli. But even then, good criminals check the blades and not the body. And yeah, you kind of get the point there of the cosmetic changes. Asimo also uh, seemed to have added a new raindrops, although uh, I'm not sure how visible the raindrops are in this highly compressed Twitter video here. So uh, I'm just going to assume they change a little bit. And like I said, it's probably just going to be a cosmetic change without like that much uh, change to the actual gameplay itself. And uh, also, finally, uh, Asimo kind of maybe cheated a little bit of the license plates. If I come over here and like uh, spawn in like a road store or something and you take a look at the license plate, okay, you see it says 19 right over here in this corner, okay, I can like zoom in a little bit and there you can see 19, okay, so Asimo was like, people keep complaining to me about like expired plates, so uh, people that I tell them every year to update vehicle license plates, no more numbered, okay, and, uh, you know, cheating Asimo, Creek totally did that, alright, anyway. So, uh, yeah, here's another look at the uh, new, uh, just lighting changes here, you can see it's just, uh, kind of like the grass robbery, okay, we're, we're basically getting a grass robbery to something, you know what I mean? Because grass robbery is that term we jokingly throw around to describe, like, something that seems cool, but in reality is kind of useless. So, yeah, you guys might be wondering... Is cosmetic changes the only thing we're getting to jailbreak this time? I really hope it isn't. Because, uh, otherwise it's gonna be season 4 all over again. Like, just say, it is probably gonna be season 4 all over again. But the one thing that may or may not change it, well, actually there's two things. One of them is a bank redesign. Well, jewelry store is also getting redesigned here, and I think the jewelry store is probably gonna have a bigger impact in the bank. Just because there's a lot more boxes to punch here. Okay, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, like, there's like 16 to 20 some odd boxes now. Okay, which should be a big jump from like the 10 to 14 or whatever is currently there. And uh, yeah, you can see the jewelry store over here. We got like the few boxes over here. You can see the boxes over there. That's basically where it is. And, uh, you know, the floors have numbers now. And here's the new bank vault, okay, so we are gonna get like just this long bank over here You guys know how like the blue vault is I'm not sure if the blue vaults here instead of the bank right now But you know how like uh, the blue vault is okay You got like this long tunnel with like medium length and then there's lasers and it's open to police officers This one's gonna be something very similar to that It is almost essentially a just a narrow fied blue tunnel or blue vault, whatever you want to call it, okay? I really hope this gives the same amount as presidential vault. Then I'd really love it, okay? Or maybe more. Okay, uh, please just get more than a presidential vault. Asimo, make it give 7,500 cash. That'll be amazing. Every criminal will just love robbing the bank, okay? Like, uh, you know, if you make the bank super duper good pricing, all the criminals go there and then all the cops come and bust it, okay? Like, you kind of want cop criminal interaction in jailbreak. So yeah, make it like cost 7,500, please. So I really hope this is some really good vault, okay? Because otherwise, the uh, bank's just gonna be useless. Because you know we all hate that feeling when the bank spawns in a classic vault. It only gives us like, what, 3,500 cash or something? Yeah, that's kind of poo-poo. I mean, like, the presidential gives you 6k and the other one gives you like 5k and stuff. Or like 5,500, I don't know, but like something along the lines of that. Anyway, uh, we really need something, like, good. So, yeah, that's basically the, uh, graphical changes to this bank, the new, uh, jewelry store floor, the bank, and, like, all that stuff over here. 
The one thing that I'm not sure how, like, of a big impact it would be is changing the game modes, okay? So, like, Alien Invasion, okay? If I start an Alien Invasion round or, like, uh, you know, if you've previously seen me play it, you know that humans basically could not win, okay? It was literally just the Battle Royale zone thing and the aliens would always win every time. So that's the most steady fix that he made, like, the zone stop, like, shrinking all the way to zero, so that, you know, criminals and the cops, not criminals and cops, but, like, humans and aliens can actually fight in the middle, okay? So uh, that should make it a lot better, but, uh, let's be honest here, how many people actually will play Alien Invasion in Jailbreak? Not that many. And a lot of people just play Jailbreak like it's Jailbreak, okay? Because, you know, Jailbreak like Jailbreak is one of the best game modes it is, okay? Like, just... You know, we want to, like, have improvements to, like, robbery jailbreak, not, like, alien jailbreak, because not that many people play alien. I mean, it's kind of cool to play it once in a while, but in a general public server on a day-to-day -day basis, very, very few people actually play. And we're also going to be getting jet ski racing, okay? From the looks of it, we're gonna be, like, uh, over here. Let's go ahead and get into the vehicle. Uh, I should probably have gotten a jet ski, but we can't spawn jet skis on Mobile Garage, which is a big rip, and I really hope that Asimo lets jet skis work on land again, because right now, nobody uses them, because there's so little water around the map, and, like, you know, Roadster, Volt Bike, those are all much better. But yeah, anyway, looks like we're just gonna have, like, these, uh, ramps here replaced with loops or something. And you have to, like, just, like, drive in, like, a track or something, pass through the loop, something along the lines of that. And whoever makes it to the end first wins. Okay, I'm assuming it is, like, everybody in the server just gets, say, a jet ski, no matter if you own it or not. And, uh, you know, the jet ski is, like, kind of decent. Should collisions be on? I'm not sure. Okay, if collisions were on, then the people in the back would have, like, zero chance of making it to the front. If collisions are off, then it would be unrealistic, okay? So are you guys looking forward to, uh, jet ski racing, and do you guys want the, uh, collisions on or off, okay? And also, just let me know, like, general feedback on the update, okay? Do you think it's gonna be Season 4, or do you think it's gonna be train level, okay? Like, which one do you think it's gonna be? Now, I don't think Asimo has announced any new season coming this update, so I'm assuming that Season 5 is gonna come at the very beginning of March. And let's hope that Season 5 will actually get us something good, okay? Because I don't want to deal with no poop poo season 4 update again all right let's be honest here very very few people like the season 4 update if anyone okay i think that like literally no one liked that thing okay it was literally the, the worst update ever in jailbreak history okay it was even worse than when they added like a new ship and called it an update <laughs> anyway uh let's go ahead and just come back here okay i don't think there's that much uh new stuff okay basically just all these new lightings and stuff new lighting is cool okay don't get me wrong but let's be honest here what value does it add to gameplay very very negligible maybe you can see better at nighttime and that's like the only advantage but other than that yeah no one's really gonna notice and especially if you like turn your graphics in game down to one it's gonna look like poo poo anyway no matter how hard you try to make it look good at graphics one it's probably still gonna look poo poo so i should also probably mention that jailbreak has an official bug hunting list now okay everybody seems to want to get the arresting bug fixed and i do too that's why i voted yes on it all right and, uh, Tesla Roadster thing, we should probably, you know, vote on that too, because otherwise, you know, I don't want to go to, like, UFO space mode every time I spawn my Roadster, okay? Like, you know, this glitch, in case you guys don't know, you just come over here, drive into any random building or something like that, you gotta go at a pretty decent speed. Alright, here we go. This is the glitch, alright? I really don't like it, because every time I'm just casually driving... The Tesla will just do something funny like this, alright, and, uh, you know, obviously the only way to get out of it is to team switch, okay, and then I lose all my progress. And I don't want to lose all my progress, lose my jetpack and everything, okay, so Asimo, please patch this bug. Also, I'm not sure if he's gonna nerf the jetpack and nerf the Volt by jetpack bug and everything like that, fix the joystick or glitching in and stuff. I did hear that he was, like, redesigning the, uh, exterior, like, of the jewelry store. So I hope that he actually makes some changes to the top and prevent people from glitching in. Same thing with the museum, okay? Those glitches are too annoying. And I really hope the Volt Bike is a lot easier to bust people off of. Because, uh, yeah, it's just really impossible right now. Especially when you use the combo jetpack Volt Bike glitch. It's just too OP. Okay, so anyway, let's take a look back at some of these uh, bugs here. 
Helicopters throwing around. Yes, that's definitely a big one. Celadors on the loose. <laughs> oh, yeah, the Celadors, man. It's also uh, sometimes when you come to rob the power plant, a random door just opens up. Okay, like, look at this. A random cell door in the middle of the power plant robbery. Okay, like, what the heck, Asimo? Please fix that. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, alien game mode's gonna be fixed. Uh, all this stuff here. Um, map randomly pushes you out of the cargo plane, all sorts of this stuff. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, okay, hopefully Asimo actually takes those bugs into consideration this update. And we should be uh, getting, like, a few of them. Okay, I really want nerf jetpacks, fixed glitches into robberies, and, uh, fixed cell door at the power plant. Those are, like, the big ones right now. UFO mode, I mean, I can handle that with the, uh, Tesla that I usually use, the Volt Bike now. And please, Asimo, nerf the Volt Bike and jetpack. Big time. They're too OP, and I'm pretty sure every jailbreak criminal and cop can agree that they are OP. So I guess that's basically all I have for the uh, jailbreak update uh, this time. Honestly, uh, in my opinion, it's probably going to be one of those smaller updates, just a few cosmetic changes. There's definitely going to be people saying, we waited an entire month just to get, like, visual changes and nothing much added to gameplay. You know, there's obviously going to be people want to do that. Okay, and uh, I'm pretty sure the proportion is going to be slightly more than last time. Because last time we actually got, like, what? Cybertruck, cargo planes, all sorts of cool stuff. Okay, and uh, that stuff is amazing. And I really hope that Asimo and Bad Season can add more of that. I get that they're busy, but, like, that's what the players want. A big thing every update, all right? Uh, hopefully season 5 next time looks really good because two bad updates in a row is absolute poo poo Okay, so let's hope that this update's gonna be pretty amazing If you guys are excited, let me know in the comment section down below like this video all that good stuff Let me know what is your most favorite thing about the update what you're looking forward to most and uh, yeah like comment subscribe and I'll see you guys next time